What up guys, it's your GM Jidel. We're back with my GM. Now we are ready to have a great season. We got Middleton, Durant, Porzingis, it's our big three. The rest of the roster is kind of eh. Maybe Frankie Nicotine can give us some pieces. Now you really don't want to trade young players like that, but if we can get a ton of good stuff for him, it might be worth it. Goran Dragic. That helps us get better right away if we trade for Dragic. Dragic only has one year left on his contract, so I don't know if that really helps us because we're going to want to re-sign Frankie. Kemba Walker! And Frank Kaminsky, but we have to give up Middleton. All right, we're going to stick with the roster we have for now. Uh, apparently, somehow, the press knew about my trade finder. We'll go Simply Business. And I lost three trusts with Philip Turner. Bruh! And we've been offered a trade. A 73 overall small forward to get a 76 overall and a pick? Hell no. What a how did we lose our opener? Wow, we are taking L's early on in the season. This ain't good. How are we? How are we one in three? This team is so much better than the team we had last year. All right, that's two back-to-back -back blowouts. Do we have any plans to get this team on track? We're fine. Honestly, we, we're fine. Our bench is pretty trash, but we're fine. It's gonna keep simulating, honestly. Nuggets, that's a W. There we go. No, I'm not trading Zubac. People want Zubac. Players want to talk to me. Yikes. Zubach wants an extension. Let's talk to him about that. I do plan on extending him, so I'll promise an extension. All right, got his morale up. There we go. Now, Dwight Powell appears discouraged by the fact that I haven't given him an extension. Now, Dwight Powell is, he's kind of trash. I don't really know if I really want to give you an extension, Dwight. We'll just light a spark. Here we go. I told him that if he signs the extension now, he might lose money, because if he plays better, he'll get more money. So I made him feel better about himself. Courtney Lee is upset we haven't extended his contract either. I mean, Courtney Lee doesn't even get minutes on our team anymore, so we're just gonna de de deny him and coddle him. And he lost some morale, but honestly, he doesn't even play, who cares? All right, we're three and three. W. W. What the fuck? W. Bro, how are we losing all these games? We are going to be targeting Sleeper. Well, actually, we've been playing like man. Durant hasn't been doing anything. Um, I feel like we need point guards, so find me a point guard. All right, Chris Stapps is ready to discuss. Dude, everybody wants a freaking contract extension. I mean, Porzingis is going to get a contract extension, obviously, but you guys all want extensions this quickly? All right, you know what? Maybe we should just do these contract extensions now. Porzingis is hurt. That's why we're losing, because Porzingis is hurt. Four-year deal worth $112 million. Oh, my God, that's too much money. Oh, I mean, it's Porzingis. Maybe we can convince him to take some sort of discount so we can bring in better players around him. Seems like a fair offer. Thinking two years around 10 million. We're gonna give him less than that. We're gonna do two years 8 million. We're gonna lowball him a little bit. Since that's pretty good, he gets to stay in New York. All right, we've gotten two people at less than what they wanted. So that's good. But we do need to make some trades. Maybe Middleton is the guy. Dude, no wonder why we're actually we're playing poorly because Durant is hurt and Porzingis is hurt. That's why we're playing bad. We're not even playing Durant or Porzingis. That's why we've been losing. Once those guys get back, we'll be fine. How satisfied am I with my current staff? I'm pretty pretty happy with them. You know, we got rid of Andrew, so I mean, I feel like the bar was set really low. It's like if you're not a douchebag, you're all, you're cool with me, bro. We are just taking L's without our Durant and Porzingis. This ain't good. The dude's asking, you guys are at a five-game losing streak. What's the problem? The players, the staff, or me? It's the injuries. Are you kidding me? I guess I'll say it's me, but I mean, like, bro, what? Like, are we literally Durant and Porzingis are hurt? We're not going to win games when they're both hurt. All right, Porzingis is back in the lineup. Hopefully that helps us get to some wins. Durant, looks like he's healthy again. Let's put him back in the starting lineup. What's going on here? Suggested rest. We're not resting Durant. Our season is on the line. We can't rest him. Nicotine is hurt now. Dude, we're getting so many injuries. These guys are made out of freaking plastic. Hopefully that can help us take these two, next two games. Pistons, Magic, those are two not so great teams. We should take Ws. We take Ls. Well, we beat the Magic. We're 6-13. and 13. We're getting offered Zach Collins and a first round pick for Matt Hughes and Frank Mason. Uh, yeah, yeah, neither of those guys really play for us that much. Might take this trade. Frank Mason, I feel like we kind of need him though. Only averaging five points and an assist and a half a game for us. Zach Collins is 21 and a 76 overall, which means he's better than Zubach. And we get their unprotected first round pick. Let's take this trade. So we have to sign somebody apparently. Let's see who the free agents are. Jeez, there's nobody. Ah, oh, yeah, yeah, ah, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. We should probably sign a point guard. So we'll sign Joseph Young. Let's see if maybe we can get a trade for Middleton, just to see what's out there. 
I feel like we just need more depth and not like more stars at this point. Bro, Jalen Brown, give up a first round pick, but we get 278s, which could help the team a lot. I don't know who we're gonna play at shooting guard if we do that trade though, but we get Jalen Brown, who's a young player. Morris is a good player. That could be a good trade for us. Son Whiteside? Whoa, and we already made a trade for a center. We get Whiteside. I could flip one of my centers into a shooting guard. We're going to trade for Whiteside. There we go. We got Whiteside on the team, but now we have a huge hole at shooting guard. We have too many centers. So we have Whiteside, Porzingis, and Durant. That's a great big three, but we have too many centers. We have Zubac and Zach Collins, both 21 years old and 76 overall. I have four first round picks in the year 2021. Durant thinks I'm trying to trade for a player in his position. He wants an explanation. Durant, you are so insensitive. This is ridiculous, man. Guarantee no trade. Are you kidding me? I've got your back, Durant. This is ridiculous, Durant. Why would I trade for someone at your position? Maybe white side trade is enough, even though our backcourt's gonna be awful. We just keep taking L's, man. We just stay taking L's. We might be a lottery team. Come on, W. W, 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 L, how do we lose to the Suns? Bruh, how is this team worse than last year's team? Durant had a good game against his former team. What do you want to do, start a conversation about it, Durant? Good job, you beat the Warriors. Bro, I lost eight morale because I said he did a good job. Dude, Durant's being such a head. I should have signed Paul George, Jesus. Would you ever consider trading Kevin Durant? No. Bro, why the hell would I ever trade Kevin Durant? Come on, can we beat the Wiz? We can beat the Wiz. Beat the Celts, we got this. W, this is what I envisioned when I put this team together. All right, no, actually we're on a three game winning streak, but we've been a lot better lately than we were in the beginning of the season. W, four game winning streak, let's go. This guy wants me to trade Courtney Lee. I might accomplish that. I gotta look at the roster. 14 and 19, we're, we've gotten so much better. But we're on a roll. I don't know if I really want to trade somebody. Let's see if he's in the rotation right now. Courtney Lee doesn't play for our team, so we could trade him. No one's really offering anything I like for Courtney Lee. Our owner really wants it done, though. There's just nothing good out there. No one really wants to make any big trades this season, it looks like. This might be our best one because we get a draft pick. And draft picks are useful, so we also get Robin Lopez's salary coming off our books. But yeah, the Courtney Lee contract's bad. That's holding us back. We'll make this trade, get that draft pick. And nicotine, man, get healthy. What is wrong with you? Why are you never healthy? Okay, 14 and 19. Let's keep simming. W, there we go. Hit us with another dub. There we go. 16 and 19. We're getting back there. AJ Hammonds wants to discuss a contract extension. Dude, AJ Hammonds is f trash. He's not getting an extension from us. We lost the Bulls. Okay, come on. Win against the Lakers. Wayne Ellington is disgruntled about a promise I broke him. Bro, shut up, Wayne. He wanted me to make the training schedule not so hard. I literally just said a ton of rest days. Like, I don't even know what you want, Wayne. Just pump him up. And he got 30 more out. That was easy. W. All right, let's beat the Celtics. Get back to 500. Come on. We lost. We lost 97 to 145. What? How did we get our asses kicked so bad? And now we're riding a four game losing streak. Are you serious? All right, the trade deadline's coming up. We gotta make some trades. We gotta trade some of these centers. We'll trade Azili. We get Kyle Kuzma. That seems like a good trade to make. Let's get Kyle Kuzma. In the game, he's not as good as he's been in real life, but that's totally okay. We're only giving up a second round pick, so that's a great trade for us. Come on, win. There we go. Come on, win, win, win. Bro, how do we lose to the Trailblazers? Robin Lopez is discouraged by the fact that I haven't given him a contract extension. Dude, this whole video is just gonna be me telling people I'm not assigning them the contract extensions at this rate. Denying Coddle, he says he's gonna leave. That's fine, I kinda counted on him leaving anyway. He has a big salary. W. W, okay, come on guys, let's get back to 500. We're seventh in the conference right now. The East must be terrible. What, now we're 10th? In one game, we went from 7 to 10. Kevin Durant's teammates have been telling me that he's really angry for being snubbed from the All-Star team. Durant got snubbed from the All-Star team? He's been playing like trash for us, that means. What the f***? How did Durant not make the All-Star team in the East? Yeah, I'm just gonna tell him I got his back. Dude, Durant's been kind of a b honestly. Maybe we should trade him. Dub against the Wiz. Come on, beat the Heat. All right, we're finally at 500. Can we beat How do we keep losing to the Pacers by 40 points? All right, All-Star break's just over. We're one game below 500, and we're back in my office. Must Michael Porter Jr kid is an 80 overall we're gonna have to try to draft him somehow jared vanderbilt looks like he could also be kind of good let's try to get a scout on him all right box that's an l dude we we just can't seem to get to the record we need to be at Cavs lost by one point hornets we won come on keep up the winning yes all right come on win this wizards game bruh win this magic game come on you need to bro win this cat bro win this game come on 
We're 10th in the conference. We are, we're not going to miss the playoffs. We have Durant, Whiteside, and Porzingis. How are we going to miss the playoffs? Beat the Sixers. There we go. Eighth. Come on. L. Come on. L. Bro, how do we keep losing? W. Dude, oh my gosh. How do we keep taking these L's? Come on, win, Knicks. How? Bro, I don't understand. Come on, Knicks. Make the playoffs. Make the playoffs. Beat the Nets. We can beat the Nets, right? Yes. We beat the Nets. All right, Bulls. We should beat the Bulls. How do we lose to the Bulls? Beat the Nets. Yes. We're eighth. Beat the Pistons. Bro. Beat the Hornets. Yes. Beat the Cavs. No. All right, beat the Heat. Beat the Heat. All right, all right. They're winning. They're winning. They're winning. We're winning. We're winning. They won. Shit. We're eighth in the conference, though. We made the playoffs. All right, the MVP was a freaking rookie, Jackson Baldwin. No wonder why the Pacers kept destroying us. They have a rookie averaging 27 a game. 2K, can you make these games more realistic, please? Jeremy Lin, sixth man. Rudy Gobert, most improved player was Zubach, who we traded. Let's see if our team is healthy right now. Porzingis was hurt. Honestly, dude, it's the injuries. If we weren't so injured this whole season, we probably would have been a higher seed. I'm kinda mad about that. Like, we just got destroyed by injuries this whole year. Hey, we took a game against Cleveland, maybe. Come on, can we get, oh, we're tied 2-2 in the series. Let's go. Wants me to bench Hassan Whiteside. This owner is crazy. Yeah, I failed the goal to bench Whiteside. Owner, I don't know if you noticed, we're up 3-2 against the number one seed. Come on, we can win this. Oh, all right, it's going to game seven. Let's see if anyone got healthy. Porzingis is still hurt. He's out for four to six weeks. He's basically out for the whole playoff. Cleveland's taking an early lead on us. They're beating up on us. Cavs are winning the first quarter by five points. We're, we're having a good comeback in the second quarter. Cleveland just stays ahead, but we take the lead. This is in Cleveland. If we win in Cleveland, that would be big. All right, it's basically like a really close tie game. Ooh, come on. We got this. We got this, Knicks. Let's go, Knicks. Let's go, Knicks. Let's go, Knicks. Let's go, Knicks. Yes, come on. Let's go, Knicks. Let's go, Knicks. We're up in the fourth. We're up in the fourth. Oh, they took the lead. Oh, we took the lead. We have a big lead. I'm going to keep it. I'm going to keep it. We won. We won game seven. Yes. Yes. Woo. Going on in the second round against the Wizards, who we've been pretty good against this season. Simulate game. They took game one. They took game two. We took game three. We took game four. He wants me to force a game seven. I might accomplish that. It's it's tough, man. Come on, we can't lose to the Wizards, man. Dude, they're killing us. What's going on? Come on, this is in New York, guys. Give a sh Give many shits. First quarter, we lost by a point. They're winning the second quarter, too. Come on, Knicks, we got this. We got Durant, we should be crushing them. Yes, we're absolutely destroying them now. This is our game. Oh yeah, we killed them in that second quarter. All right, we forced the game seven. Can we please win game seven? All right, we got, we're off to an early lead here. Nice. Uh-oh, they're catching up. Come on, Knicks. We got this. Durant, kick some ass, Durant. Let's do this, come on. Bring the title to New York. Ooh, we killed them in the first quarter. We are just dominating them in this game seven. That's another game seven that we won. Holy cow, we're a 38-44 team and we're about to go to the Eastern Conference Finals. And the Knicks cruise past the Wizards. We are in the conference finals against the number two seeded Pacers. Oh my God, let's check these minutes again. Porzingis is back in the lineup, but he's hurt. So he's not gonna be playing too well. We need to give Durant more minutes. Wait, why is Whiteside not starting? Is Whiteside hurt? Whiteside is hurt. Dude, this is such BS. We are facing so many injuries. I mean, Durant's like our only good player now that everyone else got hurt. All right, we'll go game by game. We should beat them. I get that they have the MVP, but he's only an 87 overall. Our dude's a 97. We should beat the Pacers. They got ahead by a lot in that first quarter. Come on, we need a strong second quarter here. Nah, they're just killing us this game. We're not gonna win. I'll just sim it faster. We're getting killed. We were 0-2 to start the other two series also, so I'm not too surprised. On the road, if we can get, if we can force it to be 1-1 going back to New York, we're in a great spot. All right, we're up, we're up, but they're coming back. Holy shit, they're coming back. They're beating us 10-0 in this quarter so far. We're still up, we're barely up, we're barely up. We're barely up, and we're gonna win though, we're gonna win, we're gonna win. <gasps> oh my God, they caught up, they caught up. Bro, no, they came back at the very last second. Are you serious? Bro, no. Da, simulate game. We took it, we took it. I'm just gonna simulate the game again, that worked. They're up 3-1. Can we make them blow a 3-1 lead? Trust the process, we got this. Yes, we're killing them in the third. We're forcing this game six. Oh, they're coming back. They're storming back like it's game two. 
Uh oh. Oh no, they took the lead. They took the lead. Shade. No, we took the lead. They took the lead. They have the lead. We're gonna play this. Durant's playing point guard for us right now. Oh my god. Yeah, our injuries. And Porzingis is playing small forward. Our injury situation is really bad. Durant, go up. Over a little guy, you can go up. There we go. Give it out to Durant. Durant, take that three. Take the three. Excellent release. Bang! Bang! Yes! Porzingis has like Bogdanovich on him. I should be able to take him in the post. Porzingis pass it. No! Porzingis, don't turn it over! Nice pull up three. Durant. Ah, oh, we're gonna lose. We're gonna lose. Porzingis, come on, get an and one, Porzingis. It was a competitive series. Porzingis was hurt. Whiteside was straight up out because of an injury. This whole season was just injury central, man. We really didn't have a chance with all the injuries we had. All I hope is that those stupid Pacers don't win the championship. That's all I'm really hoping for right now. It's the Golden State Warriors versus the Indiana Pacers. And the Warriors won the championship. All right, we need a new head coach. Rick Carlisle is definitely a better coach than Jeff Hornacek. We signed a new head scout and a new trainer. Carlisle rejected us. He doesn't want to coach us. Neither does that CFO. I don't want to bring Hornacek back, really. Mike D'Antoni could be an interesting fit, but it says Hornacek's actually better than him. Or we could promote our assistant coach. Apparently he's better than Hornacek. Let's do that. Let's promote the assistant coach. So our whole staff's on for a bunch of years. I don't gotta worry about this next off season. We're gonna make a lot of trades before the draft. I think we'll start the next video with that NBA draft because my camera's about to die. Guys, hope you enjoyed this episode of my GM. I've been pumping them out. You guys seem to just love this series. Please leave a like below so I can keep dropping some more my GMs. Comment your thoughts on how our season went. You think we'll be healthier next season? If you haven't already, please subscribe and peace. Yeah, got me tripping like a Prius. I don't even know a lot of people selling pizza